Hello guys and welcome back to another review of uh, some of my customs. Today I won't be doing something gigantic but I'll be doing two of my sort of medium sized uh, tanks. Today I have um, a relatively new one and one that I've had for a while. Uh, the Char B1 which is a French heavy tank and the Panzer IV which was a German medium tank. So yeah let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, I'm going to start off with the Panzer IV. Let's bring it a little bit forward. And if you, you, know, you can take a look at it, uh, it's on a, just a stud sort of thing, so it doesn't have like an actual turntable or anything, it's just held in there by a stud. So you can rotate it, uh, take a look behind it, uh, it doesn't actually have any treads, just a couple of Technic pieces. So yeah, I think the turret's a little bit too big, but uh, I wanted to have this system going on for it. You know, So yes, you can, uh, just like the real ones, you can take off the uh, extra armor, which is, you know, the stuff that goes around the turret and uh, the side plates. So yeah, that's the Panzer IV, uh, of, and the uh, gun does go up and down, so uh, yes, there's turret traverse and everything. So yeah, move all that to the side. And here we have the Char B1. This is a French heavy tank uh, designed in the early 30s and uh, uh, changed a bunch and then started and it was produced uh, in the late 30s. Uh, had, uh, it was originally designed to just have this one large gun in the front but then it was modified to have a smaller uh, about 20 millimeter gun on the top. Um, it was used in the defense of France. Uh, a couple hundred of them were made, not many, but uh, quite a few of them were made. You know, take a look at the bottom. Uh, turret moves around, but uh, neither of the guns go up and down. I might change that in the future, but for now, this is what I have. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll be coming out with more like this, and... Uh, I'll be getting around to uh, my next big one after maybe another one of these videos. So if you enjoyed the video, like, uh, subscribe for more, and uh, share it if you think you have a friend that would be interested in things like this. Have a good day, and uh, see you in the next video.